In some cultures, in one of the cultures where I come from, a child is given multiple names. Some seven, eight, nine, ten. Hey, hey. no, no, excuse me. Hey, hey, Sometimes, Ori, Ojo, James, Jacob, what is all of you? Unamdi, Asikwe. They give all kind of names. Haruna, Ishola. God have mercy upon us. And uh, everybody comes and they kind of give their names. He becomes confused at some point. In, in secondary school, in primary school, he picks some names. Secondary school, he picks some names. University picks some names depending on what is happening. They play. Yes, they play. Yeah, they play. That can become a problem at some point when the child is applying uh, for visas, uh, for transcripts, for so many things outside of the country. And the reason being that, you know, they expect some consistency. So the spelling of the name itself can also be a problem even when you keep the same set of names. Oluwakayode becomes at some point Olukayode becomes Kayode at some point becomes K. Casting left, casting right. <laughs> and it can be confusing. So try your best, try your best to spell your names the same way and keep to a set of names. Leave me alone, please leave me alone. Leave me alone, please leave me alone. If you have to change your names, change that name properly. Thank you.